is Paxton from Paxton's Downloads.info and um, today we are, I'm going to show you guys how to embed embed a video into your um, your YouTube your um, <laughs> your web page on a web page so we're going to go right into the mix and we're going to open up Dreamweaver we're going to um, create a new HTML file <coughs> give our HTML file a title I'm going to give it test and then I'm going we're going to save this file and we're going to give our file a name that HTML and we're going to save this within our root folder it says here the file it was already has already been existing do you want to overwrite I'm going to choose yes and um our content is going to go going to be inserted in between these tags in between the open and the closing body tags it has to be within this else it's or else it won't be displayed now I have two I have two files within this embed folder that I'm going to be using this one is the flash file I'm going to insert this one right now but I'm going to insert a div tag before I do that. So I'm going to go into <coughs> or insert panel and then choose layout and then choose um, div tag and then we're going to give our div tag a name. I'm going to call it, call it flash underscore video just for this tutorial sake. And I'm going to choose uh, save um no or this is our open diff tag for the div and the closing diff tag so our content has to be within these <coughs> in between the two just like our open body tag and our closing body tag so i'm going to just grab this video and i'm going to just drop it onto our page where we want the page to go the the um file to appear now we're going to close this unnecessary um, delete all that unnecessary um, file now I'm going to save this now as you can see here Dreamweaver has al automatically insert or our JavaScript JavaScript um, file here just to um, be able to for the browser to be able to display our um, flash content so we're going to go over to our globe and we're going to click on preview in firefox or we could click on just f12 and it will automatically open so we click on f12 and as you can see our video has appeared and is working is working fine as you can see here So it's um it's working fine as you can see. Now we're going to um I'm going to show you something else. We could have inserted like um a QuickTime file. So this is the QuickTime file. <coughs> what I'm actually going to do is to make it easy, very easy, and I'm going to create a link. Um create a link to that file so <coughs> whenever the user clicks this link it will take them to that um, QuickTime file I'm going to just put some text here and create the link uh, click here for QuickTime F I L E. All right. Now we've got our our link. Now we're going to our text that we want the link to be displayed. Now we're going to make this link clickable. So we're going to open up our um, <coughs> greater than or less than sign. We're going to say A H R E F and 
Dreamweaver has already gave us the int that um, this is exactly what we wanted to do so we could choose any one of these but this is what we want to do create a link so we click OK and it's asking us do we want to browse click OK and now we're going to find the embed folder that we add within our root directory it's right here so I'm going to just choose that file that we wanted to display and click OK now we're going to close this and then we're going to just <coughs> open another bracket and then just click our forward slash and Dreamweaver will automatically close this for us. Now this shouldn't be here, it should be at the end of this text. And now we're going to save and then preview in Firefox just to see what um, is happening. <coughs> No, my text is not being displayed so I think I've inserted it at the wrong point so I'm going to copy this and I'm going to paste it put it right down at the bottom <coughs> and I'm going to save and refresh my page sorry uh, your, your link is and we click on this link and it takes us right to our AVI file or MOV file so that's how you embed your files your video files in Adobe um, Dreamweaver CS4 now there's a lot of different ways that you can add video to your page um, one is you can um, create in embed a YouTube video that is another tutorial and you can also use jQuery and Ajax to actually um, create a pop-up box to, to display your image <coughs> which is very neat and you know and very um, tidy and is is wonderful I'm just opening up my website just to give you guys a small example of what I'm, I was talking about you can come on my website and click on this link and it will give you an idea of what I'm talking about our video is going to be loaded right in between here it's going to take a a, a few more seconds but no worries it will be here in a few seconds mm -hmm. another way was is that you you could do it is to insert like a flash player I did this on a few of my pages to to actually um have people you know like a more a good interaction with the with the users so this is <coughs> actually a player built in player um on my website that displays uh, my videos and these are not actually um flash videos but they are quick time videos and they're really nice and um, you can actually choose any video you want and they will appear here and here is our video this is what I was trying to tell you about so as you can see there are a lot of options as to how to use them <coughs> and our next video has started so here is what I was talking about it's very interactive so there's a lot of ways you could do it so <coughs> be mindful of that it's not just embedding your videos in one in one kind of way but in our next tutorial I'll show you guys how to do all this and um, 
just experiment and um, see you again on 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 next time for our next tutorial.